All right, so I got my shipment of Bear Root Rutgers Hybrid Dogwoods from Tennessee Valley Nursery in Winchester, Tennessee earlier in the week, and I'm doing some potting right now. So I want to show you a couple of things. First of all, this particular variety is called Aurora. Okay, it's Cornus X Rutban, and uh, you can see the BR stands for bare root, and it's listed as a 12 to 18 inch plant. So this is, this is kind of what it looks like. There's the root system, and more importantly, right here, right there, that's the graft union. So the understock that Tennessee Valley uses for these Rutgers hybrid dogwoods is Cornus Florida. Actually, the name has been changed. It's no longer Cornus, but the new name is too hard to pronounce. So we're still going to call it Cornus for probably years to come. But anyway, see that piece that I'm touching right there? That's Cornus Florida. And that piece right there? that's Cornus Florida. So the understock, even in this very young bare root stage, is starting to sprout. So what one needs to do is rub it off with your fingers. This one I could probably do the same thing too. Right there, break it off. All right, so you gotta be really careful of that when you buy grafted stock, that if there's understock that has sprouted, you need to take it off. Let me pull up another one. See right there, there's the graft union, and here's the understock. So this is the Rutgers hybrid dogwood that was T-budded onto the understock probably a year or two ago, and that's got to come off. All right. What's really important, these are going to go into pots. So these are two-gallon containers. This is only a small pot, and then I'll step them up later on in the summer. But to make sure that when you plant them, you plant them at the depth of the root system. Never bury up to here. Okay, that plant should be right about here in the pot. And if you plant it up here, this deep, it's not gonna do well. Okay, so bare root nursery stock being potted today at the nursery. Beautiful April day. And that's it.